Hey everybody, Invisible Katana here, back again, finally, with Back to the Future the Game. It's been like, three months, or, or something like that, since I've played any of my games. Really, this is the first, um, this is like the, the actual first game I'm doing in a couple of months. I've uploaded a couple of videos recently, but those, have, those are all like from the summer. So this is the first game that I'm officially doing after getting out of school, now that I'm not just slammed. And initially, honestly, I was going to play, oh, I don't even know what I'm doing. I don't know, remember anything that's happening. I guess go to the gazebo. Like, I honestly don't remember anything about, I remember it's like. It's a great place for the pinheads to play. At least it would be if my hill valley had a gazebo or a park. Yeah, it's a parking lot now. Um, yeah, let's do this. Because I don't remember where I'm at, where I am. Follow Arthur and the goons to the spot where you last saw them. Okay. Oh, wait, no. I know what to do. Let's take Arthur. Okay, okay. I'm starting, I think I'm starting to remember. So it's, let's see. Someone was disappearing. I can't remember who. I think it was Doc. Or I was starting to disappear. Marty was starting to disappear. What's with this camera angle? It's like right up on me. Okay. Looks clear. All right, McFly. Let's go see the boss. Yeah. Okay. So this is when he actually got out of court with the subpoena. And so, okay. Okay, now I'm back into it. I, I really, it's been so long, like, I don't even have my camera right. <laughs> but it's been so long since I've played any of my games, it really sucks. Like, I've gotten to play a, some games I haven't recorded, which has only been, like, Splatoon, where I just play Body, some random matches. How's my favorite accountant doing? Oh, I've been better. Oh, I'm this so sorry to hear that, McFly. Super fluid, Trixie, either. take a powder, doll. We got business to discuss. K.O., you boys play nice now. Mwah! Nice to see you again, Audie. You too, Miss Trotter. Yeah, yeah, we're all happy as clams. Now scram. <sighs> I actually heard. Oh, well, I didn't hear this. I read it, but I'm sure they're. Oh, chloroform. Are you guys stupid? What are you thinking? Bringing this fish food to my doorstep? We just thought that was your first mistake. <laughs> thinking. Look at me. Do you ever catch me thinking? Huh? <laughs> uh, Don't answer that. Look, just drag him inside, find out what he told the DA, then get rid of him. I think we can handle that. Good. Now, if you don't mind, I've got an arsonist to snuff out. And will one of you slobs start hauling these crates in? We're on it, kid. Maybe the crates or something are the answer. So far, so good. Oh, huh. uh, yep, there it is. So it was Marty. I better get in there quick. Okay, so um, what I read, which I actually, I just recently uploaded the first review, but I've been, I finally had the chance, once again, I had the chance to do it. Um, Flanged sconces. Snazzy. But I finally Content. had the chance to. One winged goddess. Oops. No, no goddesses anymore. Oh, maybe get in the crate. Hmm. Nice fit. Here goes nothing. This is surprisingly Crates easy. Ball. Normally, it... stir the soup, cue ball. Clean out the blood stains, cue ball. <laughs> I'm not a gangster, I'm a freaking butler. Now, which one of you guys goes in first? Jeez, for a gal with no arms, you sure is heavy. What's the cheer, darkness? Ow. Do you mind? I'm trying to conduct a professional interrogation over here. Where should I put There's this? no way that he'd be interrogating someone bar. that I'll just got chloroform. Behind the bar. Mm. Okay, so I just started reading uh, the Back to the Future comics, which are really free. Come on, 
Jeez. How much chloroform did you put Ooh, on that rag man. anyway? See? What? No interrogation. I'm having a hard time bringing Sleeping Beauty here around. Uh, uh, Let me see. Uh, Who's that? Oh, hey, Artie! Oh, we got a few questions about you and the DA. DA, DA, DE, D? Mm. You see what I'm working with here? Oh. Seems to be catching. Oh. Zay, wake up! Oh, sorry, boss. This stupid cold got me wiped out. <laughs> well, try to stay awake long enough to finish that poster, will ya? We got a club to open in a few days. And turn off that sign, would ya? L kid. Don't seem we need two gangster artists. Hmm. So there's something with the sign, of course. Wake up, sleepyhead. Hmm. This place looks really nice underneath the normal little soup kitchen. Okay, so. Oh, panic button. That's probably not a great idea. Whoa. Hey! Hey! What was that? It must be some wiring problems with the emergency button. Uh. Okay, as far as he's leaning, he would have seen me. Ah, <laughs> oh, stupid cold. Oh, I just want to see what he says. Oh, wait. Uh, no, that yeah. Up there. Oh, God. Okay, so there's something. It, ah. Okay. I was trying to see what he was going to say about all the You're different trying things. Trying my patience, Audie. So, anyway, what I said, because I want to let this play out a little bit. Um, what I was reading in the back of the comic, which I I'm hope totally the sisters of mercy approve now. of our redecorating. <laughs> McDermott's Canadian whiskey. Okay. I totally forgot. Honestly, I just, I freaking forgot now. I'm gonna have to. I'll, I'll probably try to remember to add it in like annotations or something because I seriously cannot remember what I was trying to talk about. No wonder Artie's so out of it. But I know I was talking about the comic, so definitely read the comic because I, I put up. Um... Oh. Still God. can't get Trixie's nose right. I can't take that. Zane would know something's up. All right, so I have the chloroform. I have chloroform. Okay. I don't think my science is great right now, but maybe if I put chloroform in the ink, it will get into the air. I guess. I guess it would. It is. It is chloroform. I mean, it knocks oh, people hey out. Guys. Yeah. I don't feel so. Okay. Say, wake up, you lazy bum. It must have been the okay. cold. Cold my eye. He's been dipping into the inventory. The inventory. I thought he was going to like backhand him or something. That would have been funny. Shouldn't okay. kid be back Should by now? Trotter. How long did you take the stroll next door and pop a jailbird? Didn't you hear? Change of plans. Huh? Word on the street is Sagan's oh. working on some kind of jailbreak, so the cops are moving him up to the state pen tonight. Kid's gonna head him off at the pass. Why don't people tell me these things? At first I was like, what are they talking about? Then I what remembered do I, I spy with went my back little in time. Eye. Word games? Okay, well, let's see what this says. Wrong button. What do I spy with my little eye? I spy a dry guy. Do you know what's down below? Low life's in vermin. Why should I let you in in case I get thirsty? Okay, so I low in. I low in. I honestly have no clue. Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Okay, interesting. This is gonna be the swellest speakeasy no in Hill Valley. It's gonna no be the only speakeasy in Hill Valley. Oh, right. Funny. Sleep tight, moron. He's a good artist, but he can't hold his chloroform. Thank goodness. 
I remember what I was going to say. All right, so what I read from the comic book is that um, I can't remember his actual name, but the guy who played Biff, when they re-released this game on consoles for like PS4 and stuff, he actually came back to do uh, the voice work for the Tannins because that's not him in the actual game or in the game currently, but in the later versions it is. So I thought that was pretty cool. I never, I, I hadn't we heard put that. put Kid's Wall of Fame gallery up over the bar. So, I'm glad I remember place that. Touch of class. Cause you know, nothing says class like pictures of dead guys. Mm -hmm. Oh, probably should have mentioned this. I mean, you guys know now, but I just thought of it. Ow. This is gonna be, um, I, I. <laughs> what the my first hour long episode for Back to the Future. Well, go up to the soup kitchen and get a new one. Why me? You'd rather hang around and talk to this guy, huh? Days are here again. Yeah, I'll just get that fuse. Yeah, so I'm gonna be doing that from now on hour-long episodes because I do it pretty much everything else anyway So I'm like this is wake up. You're like, sleeping your life away number seven twenty three thirty okay. hmm. I'm gonna Put my screen a combination down, to a lock 30 I spy let's see Okay, so we got the sign L kid So we have poster. Trixie Trotter, world famous chanteuse. I never heard of her. <laughs> Trixie Trotter. Wake up. Eggs over easy and raisin toasts. Well, <laughs> both sound nasty. McFly. Don't McFly. like raisins. Like my egg scramble. Great. Okay, let's see what Matt just does. Come on, Artie. Oh. Gotta get rid of these guys before Artie wakes up. Okay, so I have a bottle, chloroform, key, uh, DeLorean keys. Oh. No. <laughs> Sorry, that's just no. funny. All right, let's try bottle. Come on, Artie, wake up. He's too far away. Okay, fair enough. Hey, get me out of here. Keep your shirt on. Hmm? I'm not sure I can promise that, madam. Okay. Some... Oh, I thought he was going to come near me. I thought, like, oh, maybe I'll hit him in the head with the bottle, which wouldn't make sense because that would have been too loud anyway. Wow, not bad. What do I do to you? Let's find my little eye. Got some chloroform. There's something here. As usual, get right into an episode after all this time, and it's like, oh, that first thing was pretty easy, and now I'm stuck again. Like, I don't freaking know what to Wake do. Up, sleepyhead. But I can definitely talk about the comic, which is really good. They've only had uh, three issues. They on they're only doing four apparently, which really sucks. I, I think it would be really cool. Sorry, I'm just going back and forth. Um. What do I do here? Oh, maybe I hit him in the head with the bottle when hey, he comes hey. next to me. And you then hear something. cue ball will just be like, weird, what the heck happened? Maybe that's what I have to do. Okay. So Or well, I don't have any cloth, so I can't just like splash I don't know if you can splash chloroform in someone's face and I hope it's the just... sisters of mercy approve of our redecorating. <laughs> oh, right. Honestly, every time I see Matches, I think Matches. I keep forgetting that that's matches. his actual name. I'm an idiot. Okay. So he's down. Oh, the convenience. Nothing? What? <clears throat> what, what happened? You got knocked out. What? Hundred and twenty proof. Whoa. Okay. I hope the sisters of mercy approve of our redecorating. <laughs> okay, so if I don't bust the bottle over his head, maybe I do use the chloroform and splash him in the face. He'll be like, "What the heck?" But it's chloroform, so down for the count. I mean, ink, you know, took the one guy out really fast because it's chloroform. 
Well, you can't combine items, so. Oh, crap. Okay. Didn't realize it was actually empty. Uh, I hope I mean, the sisters of mercy approve of our I guess. Matches. You can only get hit so many times before a bottle now. just Snap isn't gonna, it. You know, hey, our slap hey, isn't just gonna work you me. out. You should be thanking me. Who knows how long you would have been there if I hadn't been around. Okay. Hundred and twenty proof. Whoa. I'm trying to figure it out. I'm. I hope the sisters of mercy approve of oh, our redecorating. Stop saying that. <laughs> okay. So the three of them. Those are my only three options, unless I look over here, and then it's just the poster and Zane. Got it. Oh, or maybe I don't got it. Wait, wait. wait. Okay. Okay. Again? Must have been a faulty fuse. Well, go get one that ain't so faulty. You know, some people know how to say please every now and then. Gotta mix the things together. On, I think his feet were up. just going through you for sleep. a quick second. It looked like his feet were kind of bleeding through the platform. Such an angry look on his face. Okay. Now I can use the bottle on him. Uh oh. Bam! Oh, okay. Right in the kisser. Okay. Oh. Sweet. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, you. Wait, do I know you? Not for about 40 years. Is Whoa. anyone down there? Everything's spinning. Come on, Artie. Let's get out of here before these jerks get a chance to kill you. I don't know if you guys can see Wait it in the top left. They were gonna kill me? They have like the uh, little wires hanging great. down the, through this whole this thing. This isn't funny, guys. Yeah, okay, that is the game. <laughs> All right. Mission accomplished. Perfect timing. Hang on, Grandpa. We've got a pickup to make. All right, because he went back in time, he'd be there to pick up. Stop. No. Need a lift? I thought you'd never ask. Ah, what's he doing here? It's a long story. Ah, oh, son of a. And then I carried Artie to the DeLorean. He came back to get you. That's it. So we can go home now, right? Not yet. We still have this loose end to tie up. No, don't tie me up again. He's coming around. Please you be think? careful. You won't be safe in Hill Valley as long as Kit Tannen remains at large. Don't worry, I'm going far away from Hill Valley and I'm never coming back. No! He's got to hook up with Grandma. What's her name? Uh, it's Sylvia. You know a woman named Sylvia? No. Well, she knows you. We'll know you. It's vitally important that you two meet. Oh, I get it. You want me to be part of some undercover sting operation. No, possibly. Yeah. Are you <laughs> G-Man? Uh -huh. Something like that. Sure, anything for Uncle Sam. I'll stay nearby and wait for this Sylvia. But in the meantime, I'll lay low. Good really night. should have dropped the last name when in there. When can I expect to see you? That was a close call. Was like, I mean, I know. Okay? You're not fading out, are you? Besides, Arthur will be completely out of danger come August 25th. August 25th? That's the date Kid Tannen is finally put behind bars. How's that picture of your dad? Still there. Good. Let's get out of here before we accidentally elect Hoover to a second term. <laughs> All right, so we're going to back to 1986. Cool. Um, what I was going to say before he told him to leave, I was like, well, how can they just drop him off? He's still not going to be safe. 
you know, with Kit Tannen running around, but I was like, okay. And then, of course, I know Sylvie's not the most common name, but it can happen, you know? It's like, just drop a last name in there. A little bit well, easier. Everything looks okay. Are you sure? See, McFly residence. So, want to come in? Maybe hang out a while? I want my dad to see for himself that you're still around. I'd love to, Marty, but you've got to go. I understand, Doc. You've got a to life to lead, kids Claire to raise, and, kids. and all that. No, I've got to go to the bank and stop that estate sale you told me about. <laughs> oh, oh! You go find your pop. I'll be back within the hour. See you soon, Doc. All right, back home. Dad must have used that to haul away all those books from Doc's estate sale. Wonder if Biff finished the wax job on my 4x4. I don't remember that being there. I'm pretty sure that wasn't there in the movies. Hmm. He always goes through the side door. I don't want to do that and then screw up and not get to see the bug zapper. Where did we get thing. a bug zapper? Oh, see, I was right. Things are weird. Something's off. I better use see? the front door. Just Sylvia. in case. Okay. Drop some last names. Oh my goodness. There it is. It wouldn't give me the option. Hey, anyone home? There's something wrong with my key. Please, not now. Tomorrow. Give me another day. Another day? Dad, what are you talking about? Marty? No, that's impossible. Marty was run out of town. I've got a bad feeling about this. Hey, I just saw Star Wars. Mm. Ah, crap. I don't know. Run out of town? What are you talking about, Dad? Let me in. I hate choosing the Trick. wrong Go option. Away. Leave us alone. Haven't we suffered enough? Mom. Crap, see? Get Jennifer on the phone. She'll recognize my voice. Jennifer? Jennifer who? Jennifer Parker, my girlfriend. I don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> I have to see if I can actually load. Blah blah blah. Okay, I'm gonna load this because I kind of have OCD. I can't skip those options because I don't know if I'll ever play this a second time. I just can't. I know that's not very common in any way, shape, or form to do in a let's play, but I I just gotta know all the options. Okay. Oh. oh my goodness. I have to be in like the perfect spot for it to go to the door. Hey, anyone home? There's something wrong with my key. Hmm. Please, not now. Tomorrow. Give me another day. Uh What's going I feel like on, if Dad? I do Did that, you change the, the locks same or thing. something? Marty. Actually this might no, yeah. That's impossible. Marty was run out of town. I've got a bad feeling about this. Uh, I feel like that would be the same thing you just too. Just saw me last night, Dad. Don't you remember Doc's estate sale, the DeLorean? This is a trick. Go away. Leave us alone. Okay. Haven't we suffered enough? Mom. So I'd have to go through them multiple times to get those. Um. Let's get do Dave one. and Linda. They left town years ago, which you would know if you really were Marty. How can I convince you? Tell me something only Marty would know. Ah. Sci-fi stuff? Oh, he burnt down. What scar does he have? Hmm. I want to do this, but that's from the movie. It's when he burnt the rug when he was eight. Um, I don't know what scar he's talking about. I've got about. a scar on my left knee. From what? Skateboarding down the courthouse steps when I was 12. That's right. Oh, my lord. Oh, what are cannon. you waiting for, George? Let him in. What is going on Stupid here? Locks. Marty! Oh, 
party. Whoa. Oh my God, Dad. What, what happened to you? What do you think happened, butthead? Biff. Ooh, baseball bat. I thought we told you to stay out of town, shrimp. Biff, whatever's going on, I'm a sure dance. we can handle it. A dance. Uh, reasonably. Who are they? Why would Marty be running out Like of town? you don't know Cliff and Riff. <laughs> what do you think we should do with him, baby bro? What Biff, we should have done Riff. years ago, big bro. This I'm going to enjoy this, McFly. Wait, wait. I'm, I'm trying to process here. <sighs> Where do these other tannins come from? From a mommy tannin and a daddy tannin. <laughs> It's called the birds and the bugs, butthead. Uh, dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge left. Jeez. Ooh. Tell me. Wonder what would happen if I dodge right. Uh. <laughs> How long have you been coming down on my dad like this? Ever since that school dance when Georgie laid Biff out in the parking lot. <laughs> Shut up. It's not funny. Someone messes with the Tannen family, the Tannen family never lets him forget about it. Okay, well, let's dodge left again. Oh. I got a question. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Why are you guys so pissed at me? You don't remember? You've really lost it, McFly. Think back. The thing with the manure truck. Which one? Uh, I guess. Oh, I guess I it's just understand. going in circles. <laughs> what about my mom? I mean, how did she end up with my dad? Beats us. Guess she has a thing for losers. She could have had any one of us, but she went for old Gimpy McFly. I guess I get Man. these three questions. Uh, where's your dad? Wait, does all this have something to do with Kid Tannen? Pop, what about him? He was supposed to end up in jail. Jail? Pop's never spent a day in jail in his life. The Tannen gang's the fifth mm. most dangerous crime family in California. We got connections all over the place. No way. You don't believe me? Oh, no. oh, this is 007. That's a water gun, isn't it? Hey! Ha ha! Okay. Check like it, it out. To your family from mine, in gratitude for your continued service, JJ Valenti. That's Don Valenti, godfather of the Sacramento mob. The third most dangerous crime family in California. Ooh. Huh. And another thing. <laughs> um. <laughs> What are you guys doing here anyway? That stupid that three part time, of the month. time for Georgie to pay up. We usually take the payment in cash, but this month we can take it out of your hide. Uh, let's do this. Ooh. There it is. Okay, but. Mm. Well, you kind of answered the, the real question. Did you do to my dad? Your dad's been in that wheelchair since before you were born, butthead. And you better hope he has a spare, because you're going to need one in like three seconds. Uh, this way. Ooh. Obviously going through all the rotations Here's of questions. I, I do understand. like how they did this. This is actually kind of cool. Why can't you pick on somebody else? Like each we spot do. has we its own three questions. It's kind of our thing. Do the run out of town question. It might just let and me go through thing. all, you know, all of them. When did I get run out of town? Two years ago. Don't you remember? We made a so. deal that we'd go easier on your old man if you left. Oh. But now you're back, so the kid gloves can come off. Uh. This. And turn the camera back One on. One more question. 
Biff, what happened to you? I don't know why it's on a delay like that. When I left like here, you were kind of afraid of my dad. Afraid? <laughs> <laughs> no Tannen ain't never been afraid of no McFly. Okay. Ooh. And another thing. And the final question. Look, can we bury the hatchet already? Even better idea. I bury this nine iron up your backside. Ooh. Hey! <laughs> Let me ask. Shut it. Oh. I was wondering. Don't. Let's see what this does. Oh. <laughs> I was wondering. Don't. Okay, tell me no this. More questions. If I duck, he should hit that and then should electrocute him. Somewhat. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. I can't believe that was the answer. I was like, okay. I I just jumped to He's see what okay. would happen. That was pretty cool though. I never should have let that floozy talk me out of rubbing out your grandfather. Huh? Kid? No one in Hill Whoa. Valley messes with the Tannen family. Get in! This timeline's been compromised! Oh, Clearly. Okay, so... Somehow, something we did in 1931 allowed Kid Tan to escape his date with justice. As a consequence, the Tannins have been unchecked in Hill Valley for over 50 years. Maybe it's... um... Ah, jeez. Grab the arcade! We've got to go back to that the sucks. day Kit Tannen was supposed to be arrested. Figure Maybe it's because of the arson or Otherwise, something. you could be forever stuck in a town owned by the Tannens. Not an option, Doc. Been Punch there, it. done that. Isn't it weird that, I mean, obviously, if you haven't seen the movies, you're like, this is but isn't it crazy that, I thought he would say something. Isn't it crazy that when Biff owned the future in part two, it was completely destroyed, but when his entire family is like the mob, it's still the same, pretty much. Like, they're still, you know, they're the mob, but it's not like completely destroyed in chaos that he's in control. But if it's his dad, it's like pseudo old school type of mob control. Like, that's really weird to think that, like, hmm, him by himself. Casino okay, Doc. let's run through this again. Royale style. Kid Tannen is supposed to be betrayed by his mole, the same name of Pixie Trotter. That hot babe I saw coming out of the oh. speakeasy. Exactly. Well, when maybe she does, why we never heard of her. She says Tannen will be arrested by a rookie cop by the name of Danny Parker. Parker? Parker? Hey, do you think he's related to Jennifer Parker? My girlfriend? Could be. Hmm. Heavy. In Frankenstein. Any event, somehow we've changed Those history on the so that either of these events happens. Condemning your family to generations of abuse at the hands of a Tannen crime family. We need to go back into Tannen speakeasy, find out what's gone wrong, and get Kid Tannen arrested. No problem, Doc. Man, Let me just put on my hat and I'm good to go. Spiffy. Is the mustache really necessary? <laughs> it's essential. You can't let Kid know that you're the same troublemaker that foiled his attempt to kill me. Are you sure you can't come in with me? It's far too dangerous. You may be easy to disguise with your nondescript features, but ever since my daring escape from the police and the mob, my distinctive face has been plastered over every paper from here to Reno. Nondescript? I'll find a safe place to hunker down. That flop house ought to fit the bill. You can find me there if you need me. Okay. So she's doing something. We have. I assume this is one of Young Doc's experiments. Huh, looks like Emmett's been busy. Yeah. So we might get to see him again. Although I guess the mustache will throw him off, like Superman or something. Pardon me, sir. From the way you're dressed and your general aura of seediness, I can infer <laughs> only one thing. 
You're heading for Tannen's speakeasy, am I right? Uh, yes, uh, I yeah. am. Can't you tell me the way? Down, straight down. The last stop before the inferno. Unfortunately, I don't have the power to stop you, but I beg you to tarry here a few more seconds and listen to my song. Me, 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 me. Oh, no. You say you've lost your self respect, but you should care. Oh, stop. <laughs> What in heaven's name? Oh, sorry, Miss Strickland. <laughs> oh my goodness! I've gone momentarily awry. Mr. Brown, that was why funny is there about. a dog in that vehicle? Why? Isn't that oh, Einstein? Well, Did we leave Einstein? Of course. Hello, Sonny. Sonny, Mr. Crockett, what are you doing in that getup? Uh, I'm going undercover. Not the best reporter, How exciting. huh? You'll have to give me an exclusive sometime. Right now, I've got some souls to save. And you'll have to get an eyeful of my newest experiment. You're not angry about the rocket drill? Oh, water over the bridge. I've moved on to bigger and better things. Come by the gazebo when you get a chance. I'll be setting up. You won't believe what Ine and I have been up to. Famous last words. All right. Now, where's that speakeasy? This is a really bad disguise, and I'm, I forgot about that. I can run. Oh, crap. Oh, wait. I guess I should go in the back. It's a really bad disguise. Nice suit. Bad disguise. Who sent you? Ulysses S. Grant. What did you bring me? Meat and potatoes. What's the word? Words are for wimps. Okay. I just I don't know they put <laughs> they put it there it's like well now I have crates. to click I'll on speak it for the soup okay just throw stuff at me it's who like, gave oh, you the right okay. to knock on my door Bruce Springsteen ah. okay could you repeat that who gave you the right to knock on my door? Joe Piscopo. Uh, let's go with Doris Day. Doris I don't know Day? Why. What will you do if I break your leg? Uh, like. <laughs> uh, I'm just throwing some joy. Here. Take a hike, squirt. Okay. It's it's crazy. I even got past that first part. I didn't know there were gonna Who be multiple. Told you about this place. Place to call to my travel agent. What's the big idea? Uh, stitching time saves nine. <sighs> Settle down, Mister. Why don't you wait outside and take a nap? Napkin, please. I've made a mess. I'm not gonna remember. I already forgot the first thing he said. I still remember the first guy, like Ulysses S. Grant, but. Okay. Uh... No, that's probably not the smartest choice in the universe. Dang, what did I do with the recorder? Who is the king of Siam? Come on. What? Am I? What will you do tomorrow? Uh. How do I keep you in the first part? Row my boat. Row my boat? Where did you come from? From Russia with love. Uh. Falcon Crest. What is it? Hattiesburg. Oh, <laughs> I guess not. All right. Who told you to come here? Oh, what? I'm just gonna see what this scene? does. Okay. Who died and made you boss? Oops. Hieronymus Bosch. I don't even. Yeah, I didn't even mean to actually push that one. Who my gave bad. you the right 
to knock on my door. Ah. Okay, door is day. What will you do when I send you away? Sidle up to your boss. All right, I, I don't. Like, how many of these things no am I going to have to listen to? No solicitors. Ah, terse and to the point. Who's your commanding officer? Commanding officer, uh, sir. Sir Galahad, really? Is he as tall as he appears on screen? On screen, uh. Screens can be deceiving. I'm very confused by these hints that they're given because that no, nothing that anyone has said has been even remotely an answer that I could give. It's the same questions, or it's the same answers. Uber 28, a chicken in every pot. How's that working out, Herbie? <sighs> okay, let's see what we got. Oh, this is the guy's statements in the page of sponsors. How did the latter relate to the former? Oh, I'm an idiot. Okay. Who died and made you boss? I forgot what the uh, screw it. War is day. Okay. Who gave you the right to knock on my door? <sighs> wow, I am War is day? What the will biggest you do idiot if I break your leg? Break your leg. It can't be this. I'm break your leg. Lego your ego? Where do you hang your hat? Okay. Hattiesburg. Man, Welcome I'm dumb. To but L I kids, thought sir. there was no possible way. Lego your ego was going to be an actual answer because it's like saying from Russia with love it's just something from the 70s and 80s. I mean Lego your ego is still a thing but I'm a little mad honestly <laughs> that that was the answer because that makes no sense. Also he's got a mustache just Ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to once like again present Supergirl. the Same hottest thing. little number this side of the Rockies. Classes, and when people. I say my pleasure, I think you all know what I'm talking about, am I right? So let's have a big L Was kid welcome laughing? for the one, the only, Trixie Trotter. They say I'm crazy, got no sense, but I don't care. They may or may not mean offense. Where are these subtitles Out of my way, from? kid. I got some sorrows to drown. How'd he get out? Or get in? Hey, I know you. You're... Parker. Osfer. Danny, Danny Parker. Hill Valley PD. Osfer. Uh, have we met? You, you look no failure. Nah. Muffle. Well, I've never heard that before. Sit down and have a drink on me. If I never successful uh, Could you be drinking so much on duty? Probably not. But this joint ain't open when I'm off duty. <laughs> uh, I hear you've been having troubles. Troubles? Mm. Buddy, nobody knows Bro. the troubles I've Music stop it freaked me out for a second. Wanna talk about them? Do do I? Do I? Yeah, I do. Listen. It all started when this is gonna bomb car. It. Every morning, every what? evening, ain't we got fun? Not much money, oh, but honey, ain't we got fun? What is happening? Well, yeah, now about those we troubles. <laughs> oh, I don't want to wallow in misery. I came here to get happy. Hallelujah! In the winter, in the summer, our ancestors, just the things we don't know. 
Okay, I'm almost... Oh, I still got like 15 minutes. This won't do anything, I'm sure. Shouldn't you be arresting Tannen? For what? Well, for running a speakeasy, for one thing. Well, I like this speakeasy. So there. Besides, if I arrested him, I'd have to arrest you and me and everyone else in here. And that's just way too much work for one little cop like me. So okay. back those troubles. Troubles? Ha! <laughs> I don't want to talk about all that depressing stuff. I want a party. Whee! He seems like the type of person that spits when he See has his later, peas Danny. and stuff. I'll be here. <laughs> I'm supposed to get this right guy face. to arrest Kid Tannen tonight? Okay. Uh, let's see. You in? That's the guy Why that not? had to do the um. Had to do the passwords. Yeah, uh, double zero. Uh, is this a good idea? I don't have any money, but bet on black. Something tells me black's gonna hit. Twenty-three. Yeah. I just want to see if I can even win. Uh. Evens Probably my still lucky end up number. Up. Double zero. No. Yes. Oh, my ears feeling weird. All right, let's talk to some random other people. Oh. The shrew didn't burrow deep enough. Cool. So can't talk to the random lady. Probably shouldn't. He was walking right towards that. That wasn't. So I don't care. I don't care. It's the lyrics to her song. Excuse me. Are you Trixie Trotter? That's what it says on my dressing room door. At least it would if I had a dressing room. Keep hearing stuff. Because I'm at work. All the noises, I'm like, is there someone in the room? Oh. Oh. <laughs> it's a nice What's a nice guy like you doing with a guy like Tannen? Oh, kid ain't so bad. He just takes some. Hey, Toots, any chance you could sing that can can number? The guys really love the way it shows off your uh, assets. <sighs> Whatever you say, Cans, kid. If you will. <laughs> and quit lazing around. I ain't paying you to yak with the drunks. You ain't paying me at all, you bum. What were we talking about again? You were telling me what a great guy Kid is. Yeah, I guess he is a pretty crummy boyfriend. But until my insurance policy checks out, I guess I'm stuck with him. Insurance? Yeah. Hmm, Look, can't kill I may him. not be the brightest bulb in the marquee, but even I know. You don't break up with a creep like Kid without something to keep him from going all crazy on you. What's this insurance policy all about? Are you kidding? There's only one person I trust with my secrets. But I ain't seen him in weeks. You don't mean... Artie McFly. Artie McFly. You know him? Not as well as I thought. Before he took a powder, Artie was tutoring so me in all weird. sorts of stuff. Etiquette, philosophy, accountant. He's a regular renaissance man. He even had one of those smart guy professor's pipes, see? Can I borrow this? Sure. Maybe. I've been secretly I guess he'd working on my his... get out of kid card for weeks now. But Scrambled. Artie's the only one I trust to check my work. You can't be too careful when you're dealing with a maniac like Kid, you know? Interesting. Hey, you can trust me. Come on, what's the dirt you got on Kid? Nix on that. I ain't spilling nothing till I talk with Arthur Mc... Oh, F-L-Y. Okay. Hey, if I arrange this a meeting crazy. with Artie, could you use that insurance of yours? Use it? Heck, if what I'm sitting on pans out, I could send that bozo all the way to the big house. I'll see what I can do. I really like your voice. Thanks. You should hear me when I ain't so under the weather. You're sick? 
Jeez. Oh yeah, sore throat. That's why I'm giving Cube all so many extended solos tonight. I kind of wondered about that. Do you know Sister Christian? I don't <laughs> do religious tunes. How about Stairway to Heaven? I sing popular songs, kiddo. You want hymns? Go to a church. You know what you'd sing great? This one song by... Take it up with the piano player. He does the set list. I just wanted to you know see all the options. You know what you'd sing great? This one song by... Take it up with the piano... Sister Christian, you're the only one. Hey, your songs seem to have a big effect on Officer Parker over okay. there. I am humbled and gratified that my musical gifts have fallen upon such receptive ears. That was quite the sentence. I don't care. What are those? Are they lyrics for one of your songs? I haven't memorized them yet. Wasn't she just singing that song? Okay, okay. Break a leg out there. Thanks. She's supposed to turn on Kid Tana tonight? Okay, <laughs> Doc, if you say so. So how... Okay, so I have to get from here to Arthur to somewhere in between for both of them. I don't know. I don't know. Um, how much time? I still got a couple of minutes. I didn't set my timer for this one. It's been so long. I totally forgot to set my timer. Okay. So I have to go from here to Arthur. Somewhere in the middle. Angry song, sad song, secret song. This is exactly what was just there. Okay, I get it now. Whisper in my ear so no one can hear. Secrets are for sharing love. They're not meant for blaring love. Whisper in my ear so no one can hear. Shh. Hmm. Whisper in my ear. Let me read you soft and clear. Don't make it for TC Mo. Make it pianissimo. Danny. You. So about those troubles. Eh, I'm not really in the mood to talk about them right now. I just want to drink and listen to Trixie. Yeah. See you later, Danny. Probably gonna be a sad be song. Here. Sad or angry, I think. They're like the two two big factors, emotional factors, to kind of get people going. Uh, let's. Try sad first. The melancholy baby. Excuse me. I wonder if these are real songs. Just, you know, so old that they can, um, use them without copyright. Is <laughs> Maybe just like the perfect arch loop. Danny. You. So about those troubles. It all started on uh, uh, June 14th. I was chasing down one of Tannen's boys. When this, uh -huh. uh, this car, straight out of Buck Rogers, popped up out of nowhere and ran my car off the road. No. Oh. Then later I, I lost that track of a witness. Time we the poor slum hadn't been heard from since. That wasn't your fault. And then, to top it off, I somehow managed to lose custody of an 80-year-old arsonist. And not one, but two of those godforsaken space cars showed up and whisked him away. <laughs> That's unbelievable. That's what the chief said. Demoted me on the spot. Oof. My family sent me to a psych psychiatrist because they thought I was seeing things. And worst of all, my gal Betty left me because she thinks I'm a bad provider and a head case. <laughs> Betty? As in Jennifer's grandma, Betty? <laughs> what? Listen, Danny, it's really important Jeez. that you get back together with Betty. Oh, that shit's There is so heck with much her. more I got a little to this than I was expecting. Set me up with women twice as classy as Betty will ever be. 
Uh, okay, well, he's not going to tell me because I have to do the what secret song. I don't think I should tell you. <laughs> when I'm sad like this, I don't think straight. But listen. Yes? I like you. You're my new best friend. Hmm. See you later, Danny. Okay. I'll be here. So there's a lot more to this than I was expecting. I honestly thought, all right, we solved the problem. I thought we were going to a different time because I thought we went further back in time through this from like a long time ago when the, before the game came out when I was looking at stuff. So let's do the secret song. And I think I have a little bit of time. We'll do our secret song, whisper in my ear. Blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. God, how do I skip stuff? I still don't really know how. That's no, wrong button. I still don't officially know how to skip stuff. Whisper in my ear so no one can hear. Secrets are for sharing love, they're not meant for blaring love. Okay. It seems like it's skipping. But I think it, it was just jittery. Danny. You. So about that secret. Like oh, a yeah. Million people my breaking secret. Out. Well, you're my pal. Well, I can tell you. But don't let it get out. I've been working for Tannen for over a month now. What? It's true. All I gotta do is look the other Great. way. While evidence is getting destroyed, or a truck full of gin is coming across the county line, and ten make sure an extra bunch of bills makes their way into my pay envelope. Great deal, huh? <sighs> oh, not a great deal. What's the problem? People need to drink, right? As long as no one's getting hurt, why shouldn't Daniel J. Parker make a few bucks on the action? Bit more curious the about this last are question. Hurt. Kids a killer. Ah, oh, that's just rumors and circumnavigational evidence. Although that wall of fame is pretty spooky. Oh God, I've made a horrible mistake. I uh -huh. thought if I could get my hands on some money, that Betty'd take me back. But when she finds out what I've done, she'll never even talk to me again. What have I done? <laughs> All right. Come on, Danny. Pull yourself together. It's not so bad. Not so bad? I'm a corrupt cop who's lost his only chance at true love. How's that not so bad? <laughs> oh. Okay. Hang in there, Danny. All right, oh, I guess we have God. to do the happy song. This is getting really crazy. I honestly thought it was going to be over. We would turn back to 86, and then we'd have to go further back, or we'd just go on a crazy adventure or something. And it's just been sheer madness. And now we're, I guess, technically, okay, so we just got back from being in between the time of the first episode. And now we're after we left, and it's months later. And all sorts of just insanity. But I do have to end this episode here. I'm very excited to get into this, though. Um, I think things are definitely about to pick up because it should only be maybe one or two more. I'm probably going to have to go through all of these. But thank you guys for joining me for this episode. I know it's been forever. Um, I don't know when I'll get to record again. Hopefully very soon. My plan is to over the next two weeks or really the next week. I didn't get too much time this week either. Um... My plan is to really record a lot of stuff. I wanted to get through like all my games before the new year. That's I know that unfortunately that won't happen, but I want to be playing this a lot. Um, definitely, you know, my laptop stuff is always the easiest stuff to do because I can do it here at work. But thanks for joining me for this. Um, like I said, I know it's been a while, but I'm gonna be getting back into it. Plan on keeping it constant, even if I have to go down to like one game at a time to just go through and finish it which will most likely be this because it's back to the future, honestly. So I kind of want to finish this more than anything. And my other stuff, um, it's fairly easy to get through, like my Resident Evil thing. I only have like, whoops, two more things to get through for that. Sorry, the camera went out there, but 
Thanks for joining me for this episode. Of course, if you guys do have any comments, please put them down in the comment section below. And please join me in the next part.